Yeah, I just wanted to add, there's excellent videos out there on, on changing the intake gaskets on a uh, 99 Suburban uh, 350, and uh, I think it's a 5.7 Vortec. But uh, I wanted to show, to actually get back there to the darn firewall where you gotta loosen up your uh, fuel lines and a wire harness and a metal wire harness bracket. You need to get back there. And uh, I found that just putting a couple shelf boards up there, you can just set them up there. If they go on each side of that stud, you don't even take that stud off. You can just lay on this and uh, you can get right back there, see what you're doing. It's a lot easier. And uh, also, I would suggest taking the darn fan off before you start. You gotta, you actually have to use the belt to hold the thing in place to, to get it to spin off, but take the fan off. That way you can put your feet down here. You can sit right here and put your feet down there and work a lot on it. It just makes it a lot easier, you know. I'm just a do-it-yourselfer. And uh, other than that, I think those videos are just fantastic, but, uh, uh, I'm 62 years old and uh, I don't I don't bend certain ways and stuff and I tell you what putting them shelf boards up there and taking that fan off I'd highly recommend it